Evet arkadaşlar ben Miraç bugün sizlerle Elon Wake'e devam ediyoruz. Düşecek büyük ihtimalle. Bu arada acayip derece kasıyor bazen oyun. I can't believe it. I've got all your books. I got the cutout from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. And you keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. Sticky bull. Try the coffee. Just don't blame me when you fall in love, cause it'll break your heart when you have to. Fine, she injured it. Rusty here is no longer human. Right. So much for clarification. Under a thin layer of skin. Yeah, that makes two of us. Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Bad circulation. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? You disgust me. Call yourself a rocker. Unbelievable. You put the lime in the coconut, drink them both up. Just because we're brothers, don't think I won't murder you in your sleep. Şu taraftan gidelim. Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was. Ne çok konuşuyor bu adam. Hello. Mr. Stucky? Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. Thanks. Oh, film gibi karılar var ya bu nedir ya? Bu da hangi karı mı? Cauldron Lake is a special place, very inspiring. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. This really ought to. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you all right? The Andersons. They're local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake Lodge. Bye, Mr. Wake. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! That guy was a real nuthouse. Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. We can talk about this later. Batman here on PBF FM. I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Here's another one of my favorites to go. Once upon a time, I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years, not since my last book. And now the weather. It's going to be a clear night, so you folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while and see those stars winking down at you. Now, it gets pretty dark out here, but they'll light your way. Evimiz güzelmiş valla. It's something, all right. Don't worry, honey. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. Yeah, I'm okay. Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. 
Alex bizim karımız herhalde. Here we go. Let's take a look inside. On. It's dark in there. We need lights. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? Sure thing. I'm on it. Şalterler nerede çalışacak? Hello? Anyone here? A shoebox filled with books by Thomas Zane sat on the shelf. I'd never heard of him before. Şöyle yukarıya bir çıkalım belki. Şalter yukarıdadır. For a moment, the oppressive feel of the nightmare I had seen on the ferry returned. Ne oluyor la? I needed to get the power running in the cabin. There had to be a fuse box or a generator somewhere on the island. The cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s. Or even earlier. I shall tell you. Where do you shelter? Burada şalter falan yok. Karı. Bizim karı nerede? Hay o güç kablosunu ha şurada yer. Bu mu? Bunun ya. Orada bir şey gözükmüyor. Daha iyi ki karı beni korktu ya. Geri zekaları. Oh diye çıkıyor şerifsiz. Ne dedi ya küfür ne dedi ya. İnceledik ya oğlum. Şu kapıdan. Oğlum niye önceden söylemiyorsun? Yukarıya çıktım, altıma ettim ya. Kapı nerede la buranın kapısı? Ben şuradaymış. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I thought we could be happy here. The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. What am I doing? Alice. Alice. Honey. Hi, Abyssinia. Alan, I'm upstairs. I have a surprise for you. Ben tam şey dediğim. Ne korku bir şeyler başlıyor dediydim. Korku olmaz. Well, wow. hello there. Tövbe estağfurullah. Oyun, bu oyunda bir sapıklık var. Go take a look. <gülüyor> okay. Gerçi bu bizim karımız olduğu için. Nereye gitti dedi bize. Ha çalışma odası. Çalışma odası buramaydı. 
Surprise! Alice? No, is there? What is this? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past- Damn, Alice, you- Everyone Hey, keeps... hey, hey! Just hear me out! There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe... So now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that! That's not- Alan? Alan? I don't! Just don't! I don't want to hear it! God damn it, Alice! God damn it! I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. from one nightmare and entered another. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Among Alice's things was a book. The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Benzin istasyonu ulaşacağım da şöyle korkulu şeyler yapmayın vallahi sinir oluyor ama. Oğlum normal normal gidiyoruz. Gidiyor araba düşüyor ya. Ben ne yapayım ya? Hello? Hello? Her yerde ışık var Hello? oyunun başından beri. Someone there? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night.
Bakın yani, burada bak el finali tutmuyor, tutmuyor karıyı. Niye el finali tutuyorsunuz arkadaşım? The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. Lan sen de find the phone, find the phone. Aynı şey söyleyip duruyor mu? Anybody there? Please, I've been in an accident. Oto. Şerefsiz baltacı var değil mi? Hey! Korktun. Hey you! Fail. There's been an accident. I need help. Listen, I I need to premium cabins for rent in Whitefall. Oh hell. Carl Stucky. Please to meet you. Non-refundable reservation has required. Fair and square. Fuck you, dear me. I'm gonna blow it. Fair and square. Second now, and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. Oh, Adam, how are you doing? Yeah, you're like me. Eyes on the sharp object. Bu, biz hala konuşuyoruz. Konuş sen önce. During your trying, it's the latest in. I wasn't about to open the door as long as I was liable to catch an axe with my forehead. Let you kill one stone. You can see the sights and keep those cholesterol levels down. Nereden çıkacağız bilmiyorum ki. Yes. Bright Falls Sheriff Station. Hold me up. Hello. Hello. Hayır böyle oyun. 
niña. Evet arkadaşlar bu bölümümüzün sonuna gelelim. Zaten 20 dakika falan oldu. Diğer bölümümüzde görüşmek üzere arkadaşlar. Kendinize iyi bakın. Gerçekten oyun gittikçe zorlaşıyor. Çok zor ve korkunç bir oyun. Değişik. Diğer bölümümüzde görüşmek üzere. Sen kalın arkadaşlar. Güle güle.